Okay, so another um, one of your deliverables for your conceptualization phase is the creation of your group's design theory and your design intent. So what do I mean by design theory? Um, hopefully this is pretty self-explanatory, but it's just how you feel. What, um, what ethics drive you? Um, what you think landscape architecture should be about? And you all can definitely do research on this and look up the you know, landscape architectural code of ethics or maybe even write or type in you know, what are some other design theories from architects and landscape architects. But I want you all to come up with something because I think it's important um, and it will help drive your design. And you should keep this in mind as you design. Also, your design intent explanation. Um, what type of space do you intend to create? Um, and hopefully that'll be pretty straightforward too. In this sense, I'm just saying I intend to create a space that would be calming and offer reprieve from painful thoughts and memories. And when you do, and when you do your design intent, you want to be thinking about um, the people that you're designing for. You know what things you. Would you like to see if you were there, if you were them, if you were in their shoes? Um, and that should also be a very strong guiding force as you um, go through conceptualization on into design development. And you'll just create this in one document. And again, um, I want to reiterate just your formatting um, or your file structure. I'm under conceptualization, again, and design theory and, and intent. And that's all there is to it.